Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I feel guided to do a full moon message from the moon for the 16th of July 2019. Now I believe that we are all energy and so is the moon so I thought it'd be great to get a full moon message for you all. So pick which group that you feel most drawn to and we'll see what the full moon messages are for you. Now I have no idea what is going to come through so I just trust and um, bring the intention of bringing healing, growth and inspiration for moving forwards in your life. So pick which group you feel most drawn to. We've got group one, group two and group three. Okay, for those of you who picked group one, let's have a look what full moon messages the moon has for you. Okay, first message we have is universe. Wow. And to me, it looks a little bit like that lunar energy and you've got that universal energy. So this is about uh, coming into connection with the universe, coming into flow with the universe, but also about... Uh, completions okay with the full moon having a look at what it is that you need to complete in order to move forwards in your life what is it that you're wanting to manifest what is it that you're working with the universe to manifest and what needs to go in order for that to come in because what uh, the universe is made up of all balance so when we want to create something new a lot of times we've got to release something let go of something that's old, that's not needed, that doesn't serve us so that we can make way and make space, okay? For instance, if you're still holding on to an ex, okay, how can you let love in, okay? So that's just an example, all right? So let's have a look what other messages there are here. We've got the base chakra, okay? So uh, getting grounded is going to be really important for you. Also, um, I feel like, you know, again, this is about you manifesting physically what it is you want. So what is it that you need to let go of in order to to start a new path, in order to create uh, a new experience in your physical reality? So it's tangible. So it's not just something that you're imagining, but it's actually something that you really get to experience, okay? And something that also I'm hearing like, your what it is that makes you feel really secure in your life because so this could be a particular job that you're wanting to manifest it could be uh, a new home that you're wanting to move to it could be it could even be a new love that you're wanting to manifest however it looks for you whatever it is that you're wanting to bring in right now and I you know I really feel like you know what that is that the universe wants to help you create this, but it's look it's looking at what it is that you need to let go to bring it in. Beautiful. We've got sexuality. So again, this connects with that, uh, you know, that primal side, but also that the the creative chakra, which is your um, sacral chakra. So that passion I'm looking at this red energy and I just feel that passion and that drive and that that real wanting to move forwards and creating that change for yourself and really I feel like there's a lot of that sort of that it's a really powerful energy I really feel like there's something that you're you're ready to go, you're ready to make change, you're ready to move forwards and whether it is creating that new life for yourself, whether it is manifesting that relationship that you're wanting, something that is really grounded, something that is really powerful and something that has got a really strong connection, you know, I feel like this is really possible for you and the moon wants to tell you to to you know un take the lid off what it is take the lid off this box and remove any of this anything that's holding you back from from really coming forwards 
declutter. So the moon's saying, for this full moon, make sure you declutter. Again, it's about removing things that you don't long, no longer need. Things, places, people, whatever, it, however it looks for you. Whatever you need to, to declutter in your life. It could even be thought patterns, beliefs that are holding you back from being in your power. Okay, you need to release that with the full moon so that you can come onto your path. Okay, I count the path. Beautiful. I love when everything just syncs up beautifully. So, you know, this is this is about for you making that space and and collaborating with the universe and giving the universe the picture that you want. So really getting into that root chakra and that sacral chakra, which is all that womb energy that I really feel like there's a lot of goddess energy and you know if this is if you're a male that's okay it's still still for you as well you've just got to get into that real primal energy that that passion and that purpose and that that movement forward and that fieriness to bring it in and you know you can see here this this girl she's standing at the bottom of the ladder and up at the top here you've got there's a new field and I feel like you can see around you've got this beautiful the universe surrounding and all she has to do is take a step up the ladder in order to move into this new life that she's wanting and yes she might have to leave her castle she may have to leave something that she really loves okay a home that she's really been happy with and that she's grown a life in but it's no longer serving her it's no longer bringing joy in her life so she needs to take steps in order to move into the next life and the universe wants to help but you need to take the steps and when I say she I feel like that's you whether you're a male or female that you just need to take the steps with the full moon of letting go, decluttering what you don't need so you can walk forwards with purpose and passion. And the last one we have is initiating friendship. Today I'll pay attention to my behaviours and actions as I form new friendships. I will notice whom I'm attracted to and why and not worry about whether the other person likes me or accepts me. If I make a mistake, it's okay. I learn something valuable from every interaction with another person. So as you step forward and you connect with new people, okay, with these new experiences that you will be creating, the moon's saying to, to just pay attention to yourself and not the way other people might be thinking, whether they like you, just be you and notice the sort of people that you want to be around and I'm also hearing to have a look around you of what it is that by looking at the people that you experience in your everyday life what really excites you what brings you joy what's really inspiring what are the type of people that you want to be around I feel like the the moon full moon message here is that you know, this is all going to help inspire you to move forward and create the life that you're wanting. So that's the message I have for you, Group 1. I hope that resonates and helps you. Please let me know in comments if it does. Leave me a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already so you can watch further videos. Okay, Group 2, what messages from the full moon have you got? Let's have a look. Your first message is truth. And I love this because you can see in this card, he is looking out to the universe. He's looking out to the stars and he's, he's saying to the universe, who am I? What do I want moving forwards? Where in my life do I need balance? You know, what's, what's my truth? choosing your battles and I feel like you know with this these questions you're asking the universe 
the full moon saying, the full moon messages here from the moon is saying that asking these questions is going to help you move out of this conflict in your life and this struggle that you're going through in your life. And I feel like with this this person here looking at the three different people, I feel like that's you looking at your different sides of yourself. I feel like it's a time of exploration for you. It's a time of finding who you are and it's a time of finding more peace in your life. Self-love, yeah, beautiful. It's time to really release, release any doubts, okay, on the full moon. Release anything, any negative thoughts about yourself, about your body, about who you are or who you might have been. I feel like there's some resentments there. I feel like some of you are, are feeling like you regret some things that you might have done or that you might have said. But the moon's wanting to tell you that release that. Let it go so that you can come into more wholeness and self-love. And this is how you're going to find who you really are. It doesn't matter what we've done in the past. It doesn't matter who we were in the past. What matters is who we are now, who we are in this moment and what decisions we make moving forwards. Free yourself, I keep hearing. Free yourself. It's time for that freedom in your life. Okay, that's, all, that's what I just keep hearing over and over in my head. Okay, rescuing myself. Today I will not wait for someone to come to my aid. I'm not helpless, although help may come. I'm my own rescuer. My relationships will dramatically improve when I stop rescuing others and stop expecting others to rescue me. So again, this is about coming into your own power and being who you are and not looking for things outside of yourself, okay? partnership allow healthful and supportive partnerships into your personal life and career and both parties benefit as a result you are receiving help from heaven and from a person who brings needed skills and resources so there's people coming in to help you the universe is bringing in help and the universe really wants to shine light uh, I'm hearing on the areas of your life where it's helpful for you and what's not helpful for you. There are people in your life that are caring about you and the ones who aren't caring about you so that you can really move forwards, okay? And this can even be parts of yourself that don't serve you, don't help you in moving forwards, okay? And make you feel dependent on others as well. I know there's a bit of mixed messages here, but it is a general reading, so take what resonates, okay? The last message we have is release. Again, look at this, guys. Two release cards. Well, I look at this self-love card as releasing. Look, she's got her arms open. And she's embracing and she's even got her head towards the moon. You can see that beautiful white energy and I think of the lunar rays. Okay, the moon supporting you. It wants to help you through this process. It want, The moon wants you to feel love within yourself again. To feel in flow again. To be able to move through the cycles just like the moon cycle and embrace, embrace whatever comes. Embrace what has been and embrace what's coming in. Okay. And again, that, and I'm seeing a lot of butterflies there, so I feel like this is change and the universe is supporting you, spirit guides are supporting you. Uh, I also feel like, yeah. I'm really getting the sense here that a lot of you have got change coming in as well. A lot of people are going through changes at the moment. I just I feel like there's, there's something about the energy at the moment that a lot of people are making changes in their life, okay? And 
the the moon is helping you so get out and sit in the moon and allow the moon to help calm you and to help cleanse you and to help you moving forwards so that's the message i have for you i wish you all the best and please like and subscribe to my channel for further videos in the future okay last but not least group three let's have a look at what messages the moon has for you about the full moon what full moon messages does it have let's have a look we have the solar plexus spread your wings okay beautiful and unleash your creativity wow this is a really special message for you because right now you're coming into your power and you are learning to shine your light you are spreading your wings it's you're on your magical path you're on your destiny you're on your spiritual path and it's time for you to release your you know unleash your creativity and put the pieces together in your life and create from your heart what it is that you're wanting and put your intentions i'm hearing um when you come up to the new moon uh remember to put your new intentions forwards okay because that's going to really help propel you forwards so i feel like with the full moon for you it's about releasing any doubts about your path because you are on the right path okay that's the message power of prayer give this situation to god for uplifting and healing and be open to miracles heaven's unlimited resources love and answers are awaiting your prayers be sure to act upon the divine guidance god gives you gives to you in response to your prayers so don't forget to ask for help where you need it get into that beautiful uh belief of you know having that faith having that trust and knowing that you are being fully guided and that you are on the right path and not to have any doubts okay and if you if, if you are still having doubts ask spirit to, to help you change your frame of thinking to move into more love based thoughts into more trust okay making the right decision today i will search for my own truth and i will allow others to do the same i will value the worth of my own vision and the vision of others we are all on our own paths making the decisions that are right for us so follow your path create your path from your heart don't worry about what other people think or the way other people want to live respect for the way you know respect that they have their opinions or respect that they have a way of life that's right for them but you're on your path now and you're following your heart and you know the moon's saying keep that up keep following your heart and trust and don't doubt the decisions you're making and yet yeah, resistance okay so when you doubt that causes resistance because the universe the moon wants to help you move forwards okay it wants it, it you know you're on the right path and it wants to help you to to really open up to what it is that you're wanting to bring into your life but when you doubt yourself and you listen to others it's it puts a pause on your creativity it blocks your creativity it causes resistance okay so look at things try to see things in another way try to tell yourself you know some tell yourself some positive affirmations saying you know i can i know my way i trust i trust the universe taking me in the right direction you know look for what feel into it and see what messages you get that gonna help you moving forwards okay with that um yeah i'm getting a lot of conf I'm, I'm stopping and starting and getting and getting confused which tells me so my my um 
that's how spirit tells me that you're confused and you're not sort of sure okay but you know the moon's saying you are on path so just it, it, there's a lot of trust needed a lot of faith needed here okay so that's the message for you and released any doubts okay with the full moon and then when you come into that new moon create and don't allow us that resistance in okay i hope that helps you moving forwards i wish you all the best and let me know in comments if that resonated for you like my posts and please subscribe for further videos thank you very much